Second race is into the stretch. It's the 2004 championship final of the Breeders' Crown. Two-year-old trotting fillies. And they're off and trotting. A strong start attempted in the center by Darling Monique. Along the inside, Honor Way has had an exceptionally good start. Twin B Serena is sprinting out with her. Flirt and Miss tucks behind them from the outside. Seducer Hall and going to be sixth over into the first turn is the heavy favorite. That's Solvay and Dave Miller getting a good tuck in for their prospects in the early going. Third to last, Lady Maddock held on the outside with strong T with one beaten. Tracy Spur was last away. The opening quarter in a spirited 27-1. One fifth. That's a Breeders' Crown record. Two-year-old trotting fillies over at the quarter in record time there in the 21-year history of the Breeders' Crown. And making that early tempo was Twin B Senorita. On her way right there, doubled up in second. Flirting misses third. On her way is coming out early. Chris Christopher who has her pointed to the outside. Twin B Senorita trots on. And on her way had to tuck back in. Flirt and Miss now takes her shot. And she's guided out from third by John Campbell approaching the half. Darling Monique sent to the outside fourth. And Solve shows up fifth on the outside. Seducer Hall is sixth on the outside. Still third from last is Lady Maddock ahead of Strong T and trailing Tracy Spur. Flirt and Miss made front off the half of 58 and 4. 31 and 3 into the east wind and on they go to the final turn. It's Flirt and Miss on the inside. First over is Darling Monique. After surrendering the lead, Twin B's Senorita is third. Readying to pounce Solve. Second over on her way. Fifth on the outside. Off stride on the final turn was Darling Monique. Seducer Hall is now fifth. Strong T, sixth on the outside. Ahead of Lady Maddock and Tracy Spur. 128. Three-quarter time. Flirts and miss into the stretch. Salve on the outside. Seducer Hall was on a break into the lane. Flirt and miss and John Campbell going well by two. Salve on the outside. It's going to be Jim Tactor. Which one is going to take it? It's going to be John Campbell and Flirt and miss. The second choice wins the Breeders' Crown. Two-year-old Philly Trot final to Salve Strong T was third, Twin B, Senior Rita fourth, 156 and 1. And the Breeders' Crown starts the night with a track record at Woodbine by Flirt and Miss. Now, returning to the Woodbine infield winner's circle. Your 2004 Breeders' Crown two-year-old Philly Trot champion. Flirt and Miss by Malabar Man from Flirt and Victory. Owned and bred by Brittany Farms of Versailles, Kentucky. Trained by Jim Tactor, John Campbell's 41st win in the Breeders' Crown Series. That's a Woodbine track record for two-year-old Philly Trotters, 156 and 1. With the Winter Circle presentation, Mr. Max J. Hemp from Hemp Farm. And from Woodbine Entertainment Group, Mr. Clay Horner in the winner's circle. With the Breeders' Crown, congratulations and presentations to 2004 champion Flirt and Miss. Joined here in the winner's circle with winning driver John Campbell. Breeders' Crown win 41 comes with flirt and miss in the uh, first one of the night. Uh, we were talking a little bit before we came on camera. Did you have any real anxious moments? You no, know, she felt really strong the whole mile. I'd never driven her before, but raced against her and was very impressed with her. And uh, she's you know, very good on her gait and uh, very professional for a two-year-old trotting filly. Pretty stiff wind here this evening. Uh, how's that going to play uh, the rest of the way? Well, the middle half's going to be slower than usual, but the, the good ones go through the wind. At the top of the lane, uh, it was the other uh, tactor horse, Solveig, uh, right behind it. Did you uh, feel that you, you had enough left in the tank? Well, my filly was still start trotting strong. I didn't know how, who it was or how much trot they had coming at her, and I just you know, kept her attention through the stretch, and she trotted right through the wire, right to uh, very strong. So, you know, I was very happy with her performance. On a personal note for yourself, it is your uh, 41st win in Breeders' Crown competition. Can you put it into words what uh, kind of a career you've had? Well, I've been very fortunate, but I, I just hope I don't have to wait too long for 42. All right, best of luck the rest of the way. We'll let you go get your picture taken. John Campbell takes the Breeders' Crown final with flirt and miss. Two-year-old Philly Trotter in 56-1. and one.